I started just as an English teacher and then I became, um, did some second in departments things when um, people were on maternity leave and then I was also um, head of whole school literacy. When I, when I first came, I came as uh, head of boys PE and there was a head of girls PE. Then when Mrs Powell retired, I became overall head of department. I'm not quite sure when that was the exact date, but I, I was head of department for, for boys and girls PE and um, you know I had, a, I had a team working under me. Um, I suppose in, in, in science I, I used to do a lot more with Key Stage 3, whereas now I, I, I do much more with the GCSE work because that's got a lot more complicated. Um, the A-level things are, uh, are the same, and now I do teach a lot more maths, which is great. They change quite a lot in the English department. Um, we changed from having a sort of guidance of what we needed to teach per week to having very, very structured lesson plans and resources and PowerPoints for each lesson. Um, and things like assessment focuses changed and all sorts of things within assessment, assessing people progress. Um, the the A-level changed completely, uh, but I only taught the older one and didn't teach the new version. Um, and I think it, it did get better because there was it was more structured and it, we knew what students needed to achieve more clearly, I think. Uh, when I first came here, I was um, an RE teacher. I'd, I'd not long qualified, so I was a newly qualified teacher Then I came here uh, for my second year. Um, then I soon became head of department, head of RE. Um, and about five, six years ago, I became an assistant head teacher. Um, and I'm also head of RE as well again now. So I've changed quite a bit. I think governors have been given far more responsibilities over the years. Um, if you look back over the past 10 or 12 years, governors in many schools were, didn't know everything they really needed to know about the school and a lot of governing bodies used to be criticised, and I'm not talking about BRJ, I'm talking about in general, for not um, supporting and challenging the school enough and as governors we are responsible for that and we when the school is inspected we are also inspected and we're judged on our performance so um, I think the fact that governors are now judged on their performance is the biggest change.